In Kajiado County, Mashuru sub-county, herders have been left with no animals after their herds succumbed to the ravaging drought. The fields are covered with dozens of animal carcasses. Some have lost more than 50 animals that will have fetched them between 50,000 Kenya shillings to 70,000 Kenya shillings on a good day. <laughs> ile ambaye ile mabagi mabagi mambo ine hata saa nyingine hakuna nyasi kuna kitu wa kupatia kwa hivyo tunaona hiyo ni shida kubwa sana tuko nazo hapa they say their livelihood has been hit hard and their children's education greatly affected as they are unable to cater for school fees the situation has forced most men to relocate with their animals in search of pasture in neighboring counties as they struggle to provide food for their families. They are now calling on both levels of government to intervene to avert human deaths with their hopes pegged on the short reins. Pomba serikali iweze kukumbuka watu hawa na pia county government iweze kutusaidia and any other donor who is ready to support us we still need food. Hatuna option but sasa sahi mali tumefika we need your help Elsewhere in Tana River County MCAs from Tana North are calling on the national and county governments to roll out water tracking to save lives and animals from drought Unaweza pata mama anaenda kilomita zaidi ya 13 anaenda tu kutafuta maji na saa nyingine unaenda unakuta hata hiyo maji ni foleni na unaweza kuta mtu anaweza shinda hapo hata atoke hapo kama saa mbili anafika kwa nyumba karibu saa saba za usiku mfano jana nilikuwa eh, mororo hai shule imefungwa watoto wote wamefukuzwa mzazi baba hayuko ameenda na ile mbuzi tano au 10 yako naye huko msituni kabisa amepotea naye mama hana la kusema vile dada yetu amesema kina mama na watoto wanahangaika kabisa kabisa vijijini most schools have been closed due to prolonged famine with women and children being the most affected serikali yetu kupitia gavana yetu tunaomba tafadhali mambo ya maji na chakula iangaliwe haraka iwezekana. Tuko tayari kusaidiana. Hatusemi governor peke yake afanye. Ni serikali mbili tunasaidiana. Tushauriane. Kina mama wako na shida sana na isitoshe. Hali yao imedhoofika. Njaa ndio hii. Kwa hivyo tunaomba serikali kuu na tunaomba governor wetu na pia wafadhili pia tafadhalini msikie kilio chetu muweze kuja kusaidia akina mama hapa Tana River especially Tana North. According to the county government Tana River was not allocated food and livestock pellets by the state when the president launched the distribution of food to counties affected by drought. Statistics from the National Drought Management Authority shows that more than 92,000 people are facing starvation in Tana River alone. Robbie Omondi K24